Donald Trump can't stop getting dunked on by news organizations. On Saturday, Donald Trump took to Twitter for one of his favorite activities attacking CNN now in 280 characters. At Fox News is much more important in the United States than CNN, but outside of the U.S., CNN International is still a major source of fake news, and they represent our nation to the world very poorly. The outside world does not see the truth from them, Donald J. Trump at Real Donald Trump November 25, 2017 See also these Twitter accounts are killing it in Trump's America in the tweet, the president once again decries CNN as fake news, this time arguing that CNN International represents our nation to the world very poorly. CNN Communications, though, was like you trying to red, sis, and clapped all the way back, pointing out that cough cough it's Donald Trump's job to represent the U.S. to the world, not theirs. It's not CNN's job to represent the U.S. to the world. That's yours. Our job is to report the news. Facts first Red Apple, CNN Communications at CNN PR November 25, 2017 CNN Communications closed their response tweet with an Apple emoji, a reference to CNN's latest ad campaign about fake news and facts. If Donald Trump thought CNN's burn would pass by quietly, we have some sad news from him the internet definitely took note. Clapback of the year weary hands clapping medium skin tone hands clapping medium skin tone FK off Twitter Xmas names it still November morons at Navy have November 26, 2017 pick dot Twitter dot com at Ryax Al Justin Farrett Justin Fowler November 26, 2017 CNN's clapback comes just one day after Trump claimed that he turned down Time Magazine's Person of the Year honor on Friday. Time magazine called to say that I was probably going to be named Man Person of the Year, like last year, but I would have to agree to an interview and a major photo shoot. I said probably is no good and took a pass. Thanks anyway, Donald J. Trump at Real Donald Trump November 24, 2017 The internet collectively called BS, sharing out a wave of tweets parodying Trump's. Time ultimately denied the allegations. The president is incorrect about how we choose Person of the Year. Time does not comment on our choice until publication, which is December 6. Time at time November 25, 2017 So much for a quiet Thanksgiving weekend.